Hello guys, this is Dabson Ishmael. In this tutorial, we are going to take a look at how to add a WhatsApp link to our Wizard Web Builder website project. So to get started, I'm going to come to the toolbox and then I'm going to search for an icon. So I'm going to search for the font or some icon. I'll click on it and then I'm going to draw in here. I'm going to double click on this and then I'm going to select the WhatsApp icon. So let me just search for WhatsApp. I'll click on it. I'll go ahead and I hit on OK. Let me go ahead and change the color of it to green. I'll go ahead and then specify the hover color to green as well. I'll go ahead and then click on OK to change the color for my WhatsApp icon. Next is for me to create the link for my WhatsApp. So I'm going to double click on it and then I'm going to come to link. And that link, I'm going to have external web address. That's a link I'm going to be using. I'm going to be using an external link. So I'm going to go ahead to copy the link address I'll be using and then I'll bring it here. So I'm, let me just clear this and then I'm going to paste the link. So what this is showing or what this means is that you specify the HTTPS colon and then forward slash and then you have api.whatsapp.com and then forward slash send and then question mark and then you have phone and then you specify your phone number. Now with the phone number you're supposed to first of all specify the country code and then you add the phone number to it. So when you are done with that I'll go ahead and then click on OK. And then when I preview this, when I preview this on a PC, it may not work because I don't have WhatsApp installed on my PC. But when I try this address on the phone, it works perfectly well. So let me just try this to see. So as you can see, says address wasn't understood. Um, but you could try this on the on the phone and it should work perfectly well. So it, it would open the WhatsApp application and then you get to send message to the person you want to send it to. Now the next way is also going to use a, a link, but this time around a very short link. So I'm going to double click on this come back to the link let me clear this and then I'm going to go ahead to paste my link address so this is https colon forward slash wa.me and then forward slash you specify the country code and then you add a number to it so I'll go ahead and then click on ok again for this one and then I'm going to preview this on my browser so when I preview this let me try to click on this and see if it's going to understand the address so the address wasn't understood as well that's fine but if you try this on a phone it's going to work perfectly well. So that's how to go about adding WhatsApp link to your Wizard Web Builder project. You might find this useful if you have a business um, contact that you use on WhatsApp as well, where you want your customers or clients to be able to reach out to you. So then you add your WhatsApp link to your website and then your clients click on the link and then it gets to open in the WhatsApp application and then they get to send you WhatsApp messages. So that should be it for this tutorial. Thank you very much for watching. Bye for now.